Today is the day we recognize the importance of heart health, especially when it comes to women. Heart disease is the leading cause of death in the U.S. 30% of Americans die from heart disease every month. Joining me now is Dr. Marzia Leake, a, cardio, a cardiothoracic surgeon from Spectrum Health. A little bit of a pioneer yourself in the fact that you are one of just a few women in the world who are actually a heart-lung transplant surgeon. That's right. There are very few, I think, uh, when uh, UNOS, uh, UNOS is our society, uh, look at how many surgeons uh, are transplant surgeons that do both heart and lung. Uh, uh, it's probably less than 10% or 20% uh, and then it's even less uh, uh, women's uh, that do heart and lung transplant and that. And so probably well, less than 1%. We're lucky to have you here in West Michigan. Thank you. And we thank you for being a pioneer in that field as well. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the difference between heart disease and heart failure because they are two separate things. Yeah, the, the heart disease is like a big umbrella. It's like saying cancer. You know, mm -hmm. it's cancer is heart disease. Uh, and then heart failure is a condition that's uh, within uh, uh, heart disease. Is when your heart gets weak. And your heart can get weak for many reasons. Uh, you can have a coronary artery disease, blockages in your arteries. Uh, you can have a valvular disease that's not been treated. Some patients do not know why they have uh, a weak heart. Mm -hmm. Could or be genetic, right? Could be genetic. Many or reasons. Or it could be the cancer treatment. Mm -hmm. There is a growing, growing population of patients that now have a heart disease because of cancer treatment. Yeah, and you, speaking of cancer, you say we need to treat heart failure more like cancer, get the word out more, make it more of a searched topic, right, for people to understand it. Yeah, when, uh, the, when we look at the, how many patients die from cancer every year, is about 29% in the United States, 30% uh, heart disease. But when we look at heart failure and say, how many patients die from heart failure? So there are more patients with heart failure than combined breast and colon cancer together. Wow. And the, the five year survival is worse for heart failure than any other cancer except pancreatic, ovaric, and lung. So it's a very deadly disease. And I don't think the word is out there as much that this is a deadly disease. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, if you get a diagnosis of cancer, you're about the getting the best specialist, the super specialized treatment, but you get congestive heart failure and uh, that's fine, I have a congestive heart failure. Right. And people don't think of it as being life-threatening, but it That's is, which right. is why you're a really big advocate for making sure that you have cardiologist specialists involved in your care. That's right. Yeah. And I think uh, if you or anybody gets a diagnosis of heart failure, you have to ask that there is a specialist involved in your mm -hmm. care because there are treatments that really uh, can be done only by the specialist. Well, I do want to mention that Spectrum Health is hosting a special Heart Month event in a couple of weeks. And um, if you'd like more information on that, of course, we've got that event on 13onyourside.com. Thank you so much All right, for joining us. All right, thank you us. very much. Thank you. Bye.